name is Eric and I go to Right Science Academy. I am in eighth grade. I will be explaining how to put a water striker on the surface of water. First, I have the sturgeons of copper wire, a ruler, and a, a bow or a surface plate and water. First, you put, you gotta make your, your copper, uh, your copper with three, three inches of, three inches of copper wire and you measure it then you cut it first this was my first attempt i didn't have the legs measured so i so when you put it down it sinks down to the bottom see i didn't have it so when you measure the legs they sink down to the bottom but first my project includes force surface tension and density and as you see the force of the water didn't cooperate with the copper wire this was my second attempt that worked because I had the legs measured, the body at a, at a right angle, and that was that's how you did it. And when you also when they when you when you see a when you see a copper wire, a water strainer, you can you they think that it's a floating boat on the surface, but sometimes you can think that it's a bug. They also are called water bugs and water and pond skippers. Sometimes when you go to the pool, you can see them, but sometimes you don't. And that would be what you call you. Yeah, that would be a a water skater. Yeah, a water skater. And some, like how I did it, I had three. I had eight inch, and then that's when I twisted them by hand. You can use another thread of ruler, or you can use another one. I use. I twist them by hand, and you had to have the legs at a right angle and at and have all of them together at a at a straight. So when you do that, you put it gently on the water, and that will have your density onto the surface of the water. Sometimes when a uh, water starts ain't straight, it will sink down to the bottom. But sometimes when you're wondering how can they float if they're about to sink. You gotta, the legs, you see the legs? The legs have to be up, but sometimes they have to be down. And you can put them any, any way, but this one wasn't, see? So if you fold it a little and the legs are up, maybe it'll work. Let me try. And that's when, if I have the legs at a right, right angle, I could probably remake this one. Um, nope. See this leg, this leg. I make out the right one because I couldn't make this one. This one I cut a little longer than the other ones. So when I tried it, it didn't work. But yeah, no. So sometimes if a if the force of the copper wire is not on the surface of the water it will sink down to the bottom and how i did it is you can either use a ruler or you can use the other strand of the copper wire like i did i put it together like this you put it back together and you hold it together and let me get it out you hold it together by the other one like if you have this one you gotta hold it like this or you cut it and then sometimes if you have the ruler you can put it on the ruler at an eight inch right here and you can cut it at, at the eight inch but yeah so that would be my project and that's my project name the water starter bye